Josh. What's going on, mate? What's with the stuff? Oh, it's my mum's. Don't have to worry about me anymore. Don't, don't be daft. You don't have to do that. I do, Dad. I can't go back to school and it's obvious you don't want anything to do with me. Look, Josh, just talk to me for a second. We tried that. Fat lot of good it did us. All that crap you said about not treating people differently for their sexuality. You can't even look me in the eye when I tell you I kiss Finn. What would you expect me to do, jump up and down with joy? No, but a bit of help and support would be nice. You're supposed to be my dad. You remember? I'm sorry, Josh. I should have been there more for you, but I just... I can't stand the thought of you with another man. It doesn't exactly fill me with joy either at the minute. It's not like I asked for this any more than you did, did I? So is that what we're saying, then? That you are? I don't know. I don't know what I'm supposed to be anymore, what I'm supposed to think. All I know is that I kissed Finn and I wanted to. And I wanted him to kiss me back. So if that makes me gay, then I'll just have to deal with it, won't I? And if you or anyone else can't, I'll just have to do it on my own. You don't need to go anywhere. I want you to just stay here with me, please. You're my son, and I love you. I just uh, I can't promise that it's always going to be easy, that's all. Well, whatever happens, you're going to have to start coping a lot better than what you did today. Because if you can't, I won't be staying around for any second chances next time. This was your idea.